Hello, hi, my name is Crypto Sport, and in this video, I'll be going through some altcoins that I believe have the potential in the next bull run to do up to 100 times return. Before we get started, if you can hit the like and subscribe button, I'm currently sitting at 415 subscribers, hoping to hit the thousand mark as soon as possible. So, as always, just a slight disclaimer these are my own views, not financial advice, um, not views of anyone that I represent or work for, etc. So, yeah, let's get straight into it. It's a cryptocurrency that I found the other day called Haffle. It's a it's a tail, it's a layer one solution, which means it's like Bitcoin. Um, it's not built on top of anything, so it's there as a layer one solution. Currently ranked five hundred and twentieth on Coin Market Cap, has over sixty five thousand followers, sixty nine thousand three hundred and seventy one to be precise. Market cap only of twenty eight million. Current price is trading around as of Sunday, the 29th of January, at zero point twelve approximately. Uh, yearly low was at zero point zero four dollars. Um, in terms of all-time high, you can see that it's gone up to as much as $2. Um, if you look at coin market cap and the chat, people are expecting it to go up to $20, $100. So yeah, good hidden gem in my opinion. Current market cap, 28 million, so a lot of room for growth. Circulating supply of 242 million. Worth noting that they have a white paper here. I won't go through the white paper, but it shows you it's a legitimate coin. A white paper consists of 25 pages, includes use cases, graphs, the mass behind the hash rate, etc. So it's a legitimate coin, in my opinion. So what I'm aiming to do here is basically talk you through Haffa, um, what is Haffa network, etc. I'll just try to cover this off very briefly. So most simply put, Haffa can be described as a scalable and easy to use distributed ledger to support light financial transactions and contracts. It's also a consensus platform, but its architecture is novel. It is a hybrid, uh, it's hybrid one designed by DAD, you'll hear that phrase a lot, directed oscillate graph and blockchain technologies. Basically, it is a blockchain inside DAG and both are intertwined. So when the number of transactions is low, the blockchain ensures security and when it increases DAG, the, the graph will take over. This hybrid architecture creates the perfect environment for multiple use cases, especially where high scalability is needed. How DAG and blockchain, when put together, improves scalability of the HAFA network will be discussed shortly. Before that, here are some new features of the HAFA that will make it different from other platforms. So what makes it different in terms of advantages? The makers of HAFA have introduced a scalable distributed ledger for real world applications. Real world applications, it has been designed to resolve quite a few issues prevalent in the current mainstream blockchain. For example, heavy transaction fees in Bitcoin blockchain is one of the most talked about issues, but transactions over HAFA network are always free, which means a cryptocurrency can be traded in a transaction without paying any fees. Haffa is much more scalable than Bitcoin or Ethereum network, which means that even when transaction volumes increase, the security and speed of the network don't get compromised. But that does not mean that network can network uses any cent centralized coordinator at any point in time. Haffa network is completely decentralized ledger, yet it successfully offers long-term security when transaction volume grows. The Haffa network, although allows merged mining with Bitcoin and Litecoin. This means that even though Bitcoin and Litecoin miners can participate in mining of HDI and in the process, they don't lose the profit collected by them. So you can work with other blockchains. Besides that, miners receive incentives in the form of HR, HDR tokens at no extra cost. This makes miners more secure and motivates them to use the cryptocurrencies with just a few creates. Anyone create custom tokens on the Hafem network. The official website claims that a 13 year old can create a tech, um, can create one if you go on the website here. Um, the Hafa network incorporates atomic swamps. The benefit of this feature is that it allows separate tokens to be reliably exchanged simultaneously on the same transactions, which includes more efficiency in the network. I won't go through everything. You can read it on your own time. So what's unique? Hafa comprises DAG and blockchain. Both are distributed ledger or databases, but there's a difference in the structure. While blockchain forms a linear chain of blocks, DAG is like a tree where transactions branch out from one transaction to another. In the Hafa network, when number of transactions per second is low, blockchain gets into the action. If it increases, as I mentioned earlier, DAG will take over. So yeah, it's pretty useful. Like as I say to you, in, in terms of potential growth, all-time high was $2. In terms of exchanges, it's listed on KuCoin, Gate.io, so it still needs to be listed on Coinbase and um, uh, Binance. If you go into the Hafa network website, you can see it's got developer documents about us, get started. You can download and install your own wallet, create your own wallet, create your own token. Um, it has the white paper there, the PhD thesis, everything's on the website. Um, as I say to you, I'm largely bullish on this coin, um, given that it's not listed on Binance or um, the other exchanges. Half are also releasing regular updates of the work they're doing if you go onto their Twitter page. Uh, 
66,000 followers as well. You can see their Q4 report, lab reports there. Uh, if you go onto it, you can read it yourself. Uh, it's giving investors regular updates and it's a proper report. CEO gives you updates, executive summaries, use cases. Um, so yeah, it's, it's all, 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 always growing. So, so yeah, um, if you found the video useful, please hit the like and subscribe button. I do hope to drop more altcoin videos like Hafa, um, where I do think that you should be looking at low market cap coins if you want to make money on that. As always, as I say to you, it's not financial advice. Do your own financial research. Hope to see you again soon. Thanks, everyone.